Hello, only me, and it's doing this thing in um, landscape mode, so I can't see the timer. Oh dear, why is it every time I turn on the video to film, I start yawning? I don't know. What a day is all I can say. Yes, I was up half the night. I was um, about three o'clock, four o'clock this morning. I think it might have been about four. I um, was doing my perusal on, on the internet, as you do, and I was just looking up on um, Right Move because I did used to have a shop in town, and um, but this was a fair few years back, four, four years or so back, but I um, had to give it up because of my health. And it was a, it was a proper shop, so um, it was like oh, it got a bit too much, especially with um, certain other. No, I'm not going to go there. Somebody else sort of um, helped that decision along, shall we say? But any rate, so now I've been looking because all parts of the shop were nearly all because she took a lot of the stuff. Said she'd pay me for it and never did, so basically stole it from me. But well, we must relax, calm down, let it go, send it out to the universe and let the universe bring back. And let karma have its effect. But hey, so, um, yes, um, so a lot of the stuff came into my little one bedroom, one, one up, one down little house. And I mean, it's very little. So I am, you know. I think out of this house, perhaps 80% is craft stuff and from the shop. And the other, no, it might even be more than that. It's probably about 10% I've got of, of normal stuff that lives in a house. And so I looked online and there was this place and I thought, wow. And I'd seen it there, um, or one of them there, um, a few months, no, a few years ago. But of course, I wasn't in any state to do do anything like that. And um, but this time I thought, no, it was meant to be. It's meant to be. And um, and I hadn't seen it there. It wasn't there last week. This property. So I then decided, right, I will go and um, I'll leave them a message. And um, and go from there. And this morning I got a phone call from the agency you know letting agency um sales office whatever it is and they said yep they arranged an appointment it was going to be monday i was going to go and see it round and they gave me um the landlord's number um just in case i needed it and um and so i let them in bed because i was having a lazy morning in bed um thinking about it and then thinking right well, I woke up to that phone call, so I was half asleep, so I couldn't do much about it. But I'm wondering if today I can go and see him. So I, I called up the landlord and spoke to him and asked whether I could see it today. And he doesn't live in the town, so but he said he was already in the town because they'd just done some painting at the property and he was there talking to the builders. And I was thinking, oh... Oh, 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 you know, these ducks are starting to line up. And um, and so I said, oh, well, is it possible that I can come and see it today then? And he went, yes, because he also had the keys on him, which was amazing. Um, and so um, I did. I had to wake up quickly, get on my scooter, hope I had enough electric to get me up there. I did. And back, obviously. And I went up there and I saw, the only trouble is it's up like three flights of stairs, which I think is going to be um, pretty, uh, but, but anyway, so I looked around and it's only one room, but it's quite a big size room and, you know, it'll get a lot of the stuff out of this house and it's bright and I thought, why not? So I told him. I really liked it because it was a very good price and the electric and uh, heating was all included, 24-hour access. I mean, it was, it was about the same price as I would have had to pay for a, um, a storage unit. But the storage unit 
would be in, on the outskirts of town, whereas this is bang in the centre of town. So it's ideal. Um, close to the post office, close to Morrison's. Absolutely wonderful, ideal. So um, I said, yes, I wanted it. <laughs> so I just had to speak to the land, uh, the agency but he was on another call so I left a message and um, hopefully Monday I will be going on signing for it so I've got planning to do and trying to figure out oh my god how to um sort of thing out in this house I will have to get a man with a van because there's no way I'm gonna lug everything up three flights of stairs not on my back and legs neck so I'll get I'll pay somebody to do it Oh dear, it's just that my money, which I got from Pip, is going down. I've only got so much left. Oh dear, but after this, I'll probably be brassic on that length thing. So, um, but well, yes. So this is definitely going to help my sanity. And my Pip will be paying for it. <laughs> so I won't be getting a mobility car, motability car. Because I will be getting sanity instead and yep yeah, that beats anything else so we will go from there so yes so i've now just waffled on for about i don't know how many minutes 10 minutes or so telling you my news and i'm so excited i'm so so so, so excited so i'm gonna have to be looking on on um ikea for some shelves and stuff. So I'm gonna have to work out my budget later on. But anyway, that is by side by side the point. Definitely by side the point. I was sorting these out. I don't know if you can see it. I've got all my um drills, all these drills to the side. Um, these are the ones left over from various things. I've sorted out the drills needed for um, my sexy wang ebo. And that is for this one. This is my sexy wang ebo. Um, there, I don't know if that's a better look. So that's going to be the painting that I'm going to be doing. Sexy wang ebo. Well, totally sexy. He stays on my fridge so I can just look to the side and just go, oh, look at those abs. And he's tied up. Way. Sorry, no. <laughs> Be still, calm, Lord. Oh, yeah. I'm so excited. I really am, so I apologise. I apologise. I'm all... Blah, 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 blah. Right, because that's how it goes. Right, so I've gone through these. There's only certain ones that I'll need to get. I mean, let's face it. Things like, um, where is it? 844, I need about 21,000 drills of those. 934, 21,000 again. But the best one is, where is it? There it is, 3799, I need 57,000. <laughs> oh my God. But well, but so the ones which I haven't marked off are the ones I need to get roughly. So yes, so that's that one. So now, what I'm doing is I'm going through this batch here. I've already obviously got some stocked up, but I've got to figure out which one this is. This next one is my spares drip box is looking very, um, very, oh, that's what I should have done. Um, what's it called? Bear. Right now, but this one is my, the boy's hair one. So this is, see, these two are the ones I want to do as well as that other Ebo one. But I've got Mr. Ye and the Untamed to finish first. Can you tell I'm obsessed? I am obsessed with them. Addicted, totally addicted to them. I mean, but look at them. Aren't they gorgeous? I mean, whoa, Wang Ebo, Shao Zan, look at them. Oh, sorry, I could just stare at them for ages. So what better way to do a diamond painting? even if it is a cross-stitch conversion. So I'm trying to decide which one I want to do first. 
and that's 131 colours and this is 142 colours and I'm trying to figure out which one did I have it that's the size and I thought I'd put in here maybe I'll put it in this book um the canvases which one I was going to do I've got them at the back only the sizes damn I've got it written down here somewhere. I know I have. I've picked the right book. Ah, there we go. There we go. So the cartoon boys is going to be on the little canvases. And this one is going to be on the little canvases as well. So I think I will do both little canvases. Perfect. And Yebo tied up is going to be on one big canvas because I certainly don't want to have that. Oh, it's lovely. Those lovely apps split up. I've got a big canvas upstairs and I've got another big canvas for my daughter's wedding so yes so lose that box and that that book and I'm done for right so now this one is the hair so as you can see I've got some in here now I did quite a lot of this last night I mean I'll only show you a little bit of it a brief bit of it because it was long-winded because I had to do maths yep maths maths was a pain in the buttocks now where do those come from because uh, i thought they were for here but this one's held on i've got so many of these let's see that is the untamed that ah that oh dear and is it that one, Mr. Ye? Oh, bugger. 3072. Yeah, that one is Miss, is the ante, is Mr. Ye. So it's this one and these two. That's right. This is the hair, as we call them now. The hair. Right. So, another slug of this. 20 minutes in and we haven't even started right so let's get out the sheets okay. realistically i want to be planning okay realistically i want to be spending but i haven't got money to spend but i have a klana whoops but hey this is a need I want to get shot of that old scuzzy bloody uh, bookcase I've got. I need some billies. Oh, and I can move all my um, DVD racks down out of my bedroom. Oh, wickedy doodle. Oh, golly, golly gosh. I am so, 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 so excited. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm just going to sidetrack a minute just because I can. All right, this is the layout of, of the room um, there's the door that is the windows there's blinds on the windows which are good there's two rows of lighting sort of in the central part there's only one plug socket there and one plug socket, I think it's there, it might be there. No, it's it's there. So they're the plug sockets. Which is painful along this wall, but this wall, I think I'm going to put my... I need, I want two... How can I get... I've got four... DVD racks, I think. What have I got? Five. One, two. One, two, three, four, four. I'll, I'll move four. I'll keep one behind here. Four DVD racks. And so that would be Billy one, Billy two. Ah, I'll make Billy two like that because there I want tables. Ikea tables 
I have a chair, not with wheels. My chair, which I've got from, which I used to use here, that'll go over. It's not on wheels, but well, in the carpet's okay today. So that'll be my creating and my um, shipping area. So there I will have my printer. I shall take up my printer. There, uh, along here, I think I'm going to have a. I I need a calyx. I'll probably take my big four by four calyx unit up there. That can go there. And then with the things in it because I've got fabric, um, I can take my cutting mat up. Um, what else? I've got two little IKEA um, um, red filing cabinets. They can go there, but underneath. Um, what else do I need? I have a dump bin that can go there. I need somewhere for all my cards to go and my notebooks because that's another thing. This is, I want to be is my note. Maybe the dump bin won't go there. Maybe I'll put the dump bin there. And then here, this would be where I'll have my. So realistically, I need another two tables. One, two. I have two tables. So I need my cutting station there. It's my guillotine type thing, my heavy duty one. Heavy duty guillotine. Maybe this video will be a planning video and I'll get on to doing that one in the next one. That's what I'll do, scrap that guillotine. Um, and corner punch. Underneath, I could do with some drawers or something to store my paper. Paper card, sticker, paper. My brother, scan and cut can go. Plus final. Um, I don't think I'm going to paint it. I did say, would I be able to paint? He says, I can do what I want in there as long as it's sort of, you know, making it, it you know, it's nice. I said, well, I don't do dark colours. So what I really want to do is white on the walls to make it really bright. Because it's sort of like very light magnolia. And I live with magnolia. I don't want to work with magnolia as well. So I might just do that. Along this wall, there's wood. And apparently behind that, there is some, there are some um, pipes and stuff. So he said, if I wanted to sink in there, I could. So actually I might say yes to a sink. But I don't know. Because I'm thinking of teas and coffees. Teas. No, because I'll just get one of those big jugs of water and a kettle. And that, that's how I should do it. I should just get, you know, those four packs of still water and for 17p each or whatever it is. And um, put that in the kettle for my teas. Because I, I have teas in this. So, um, yeah. Right, so let me see. God, I just wish I had more of that money left. Uh, my son owes me 50 quid. Hopefully I'll see that. Right, so that's that. What else? Heavy duty protein corner punch. So realistically, I need for this is are two Billy's bookcases. Two 
I'm taking that calyx from home. I could possibly do now. Um, I'm going to use all these dronas as well. So then I can move my table more into this area. Actually, I can have it the other way. That will make it a lot better. So my chair isn't half into the kitchen. Yep, that's what I'll do. It, two Billy bookcases. Um, two times Ikea linen. I think they're linden tables. Tables. 120 centimetre ones. Um, so I've got those, got the chair. Billy's I need. I've got the DVD racks. I've got two tables already for there. And there and there. I just need to get internet. So I need to sort out insurance, internet, small business rates. Um, what else? Um, trying to think what else. I've got to focus instead of having lots of crafts on the on the go at once. So I want to focus on my cards. Um, my so we're going to focus on the cards because they're also diamond painting cards um, as well as standard cards. And my little note notebooks. And um, I want to do um, my post-it note style. Except they're not post-it notes, they're just memo pads, aren't they? Memo pads. Um, what else? What else? Oh, my fabric. And sewing. So I might just take up my sewing machine, but then again, I might just keep that at home. Don't know. I have to see. Oh dear, it's doing something now. No battery, but you're plugged in. What's going on here? Do you know what? This thing I've got is absolutely crap. It doesn't... I don't know what it's doing. It just doesn't seem to charge. Excuse the wobble. Right. I'd better stop there and call